Hey hi hello welcome back to my new video guys this is Sampath you are watching Sampath Sanfx YouTube channel and this is the extended custom ROM with Android 12 as you can see this is the Android 12 logo and it's the latest build as you can see extended version access first build it's still unofficial build is written but in the telegram it's named as official let's see and in the build date you will get January 6 this is the latest build available for Poco X3 extended version and the Android security patch is the latest 5th December and the kernel user is 4.14.190 perf Surya kernel played BGMA for like 4 to 5 hours let's see first about the battery life and performance here into the battery life you can check out here this is how the battery life you will get I was like using from 100% this time screen on time you can check out here 3 hours 27 minutes now it's 48 percent if you play similarly like 2 hours 34 minutes i have played bgma continuously just recently i played it the experience was very good but there is a problem like when you screen record while playing using this one i mean the inbuilt screen recorder like this there is a lag you can't simply play the game so i recommend you to not to screen record using this pre-installed screen recorder use any third party or even that may also even that also gets lag don't try to use screen recorder but apart from that it's fine actually i'll show some of the gameplay also i played plenty of matches here and into the geekbench scores here single score is 526 and multi score is 1625 which is very good score and the kernel used here is linux 4.14.10 puff surya kernel as i already explained this is a very good rom actually the smoothness is very good because of this i guess let me go into display here by default it's kept to minimum refresh rate also 120 and maximum also 120 the ui smoothness is very very good in my last previous custom roms i never seen this much of smoothness in any ui period this that much smooth actually this that much smooth actually only in home screen that is too much smooth as you can see it's very very smooth you get this kind of basic camera if you want you can use any gcam ports which is not a problem you can install any gcam ports available for poco x3 surya karna or whatever you call nfc any version and let's see the drm info here you will get level 1 certification such that you can watch any ott applications in hd resolution which is not a problem and coming to safety net status here also you will get let's see fortunately it's passed such that you will use this payment applications like google pay or even the whatsapp whatever apps you need to use it will work fine and into the home screen and settings you will get wallpaper and style if you go into change wallpapers there are no wallpapers pre-installed here on device only one wallpaper is pre-installed there are no android 12 wallpapers but you can install using third party applications are download side load the wallpaper let's see the dialer here you get google dialer direct video call feature is available in this room and uh, there is a record call option also that other person will never notify that you are recording the call such kind of recorder is pre-installed in this room which is good thing and here extensions you will get all the customization in theme room you get plenty of customization you can check out here and ambient you will get plenty of customization in amb animations also you will get lots of customization in buttons gestures lock screen navigation notifications power menu quick settings and status bar in the status bar you can change the logo as you can see left side right side you can keep and even there are plenty of options you can check out here like if you want to keep superman or uh, iron man you will get iron man symbol here if you enable left side then it is left side if you want you can keep right side also apple symbol also you can keep as you can see whatever icon you need you can keep here you can even adjust that those kind of customization are available this is just an example i am saying there are plenty of customization available in this room in the extras also you can check out here and going into like notification and control settings like this you will get bubbles feature is there conversation is there 
you can enable or disable some of the options like enhanced notifications from here into storage like this and you can use hd card i am already using that into the display settings there is a dark mode let's see colors you can choose here you can check out and refresh it i already explained lcd features are also given what there is no dark theme here you need to go into extensions only in the theme room let's enable dark theme this is how the dark theme looks i hope you guys see here as you can see it's pitch black condition that is one thing i always like in android 12 if it is pitch black condition then i definitely like the dark theme and all in the custom roms let me disable that into the extensions and again theme room and disable the dark theme you can schedule it out also the plenty of options these are the settings into the security you will get just fingerprint unlock and there is no face unlock and anything like that i will add it fingerprint registered let's see it's quick enough just the case is little bit inside i mean the fingerprint scanner that's why it takes time but it's fast enough and uh, there is no face unlock as i said before also and what can i say about this rom is really good actually you can try it out as a daily driver many are using it to comment down below how is your performance in this rom i mean extended custom rom for poco x how is your daily performance and how you are feeling this rom do comment down below such that other people will understand how is the performance and if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like guys and there is a screenshot option here you can edit also some of the options are given and you can clear the apps oops i cleared everything okay like this you'll get and there is a app you can lock the app also app unlocked this is a cool feature some of the things that are present in this room are very different or new thing and i used gfx tool this one with 60 fps i played some of the matches it's good definitely you can try it out as a gaming room but as i said before also don't record with the inbuilt screen recorder that's the one thing keep in mind and into the settings if i forget anything location also working fine and even the earpiece and even headphone jack volume everything is fine and loudspeaker volume dual stereo speakers working fine and nothing great like what i seen in MIUI mint version those were very very loud here i don't see such a loud thing and into the accessibility let's see whether the audio adjustment it's there but there is no enhancing of audio that's one thing and let me show you the charging animation this is how you will get under 12 style the wobbling effect whenever you charge the phone or whenever you unlock the phone you will get such a wobbling effect that's under 12 style and let's see whether we have widgets under 12 style clock as you can see these are also working fine if you want you can change some of the four presets are available you can change like this and speed test everything is working fine let's see cpu throttling test also as you guys can see i have been running the cpu throttling test like 4 minutes 20 seconds like that this is how i will stop here as you can see the maximum is 145 average 141 and minimum is 122 it's fine as you can see here no throttling even while gaming also what i said it's same i will show this one here i got lag actually let me turn this auto rotate let me auto rotate this one okay i will show you there was lag actually it's unplayable when i turned on screen recording that's what i'm going to show here volume is volume recorded it was difficult for me to play as you can see there is a lag
as i have seen there was a lag in the screen recording gameplay was not laggy whenever i turn on that screen recording then only i got the laggy experience but apart from that everything is fine in this rom this is one of the good roms available for poco x3 you can definitely try it out based on android 12 this is good rom and you get this kind of metro application pre-installed for music and there was a browser also pre-installed i disabled that and i am using brave and chrome browsing it's fine and that's all guys in this video i hope i have explained everything in this video and if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button and also follow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and thank you for watching guys we'll meet you with another interesting video and until that keep smiling bye bye for now